By the time Princeton's first Varsity 8 placed their boat in the water Sunday afternoon, the reality of the race had already set in. The team had a lot riding on the NCAA Grand Finale after two disappointing finishes in the second Varsity 8 and Varsity 4, both of which placed third in Petite Finals. That was a blow to the number one seeded Tigers, which had entered the NCAA Division I Women's Rowing Championship undefeated. But disappointment didn't last long. Princeton captured the coveted Varsity 8 crown, which bumped the Tigers into a fourth place team finish. We had an undefeated season, we won the Eastern Sprints, and to stay number one is pretty darn tough. And we knew that the competition was outstanding. So to see them cross the line first was a dream come true. Princeton's first Varsity 8 was anchored by four seniors, which freshman Kelsey Rillick said was key to the team's success. Amazing. I mean, their work ethic this whole year has been phenomenal. And for the four of them in the boat, it's like, it's, it's huge. And I'm just really excited that I could, like, you know, be a part of their, you know, they're leaving at Princeton. So, I mean, a huge race. It was tough. It was a really tough race. The Tigers Varsity 8 led wire to wire in the grand finale as it won a national title for the second time. Following Sunday's win, the Tigers celebrated the traditional way. The women threw their coxswain and coach into the water.